According to a royal analyst, the Duke of Sussex has suffered a significant setback in the United States. Despite his positive attendance at Wednesday's Invictus Games Thanksgiving service in London, the Duke of Sussex, who remained enthusiastic and positive despite the absence of his cancer-stricken father, the King and other senior royal family members, has received disappointing news from the United States regarding his latest ambitious charitable endeavor. On the 10th anniversary of his Invictus Games, the Duke was expecting to get a trademark for his charity Centibale, which he started in 2006 in various categories. He got a hero's welcome at a service at St. Paul's Cathedral marking the event. The organization has allegedly fallen into trademark difficulties in the USA thwarting, for now at least, plans to expand its operations in America, according to royal analyst Richard Eden of the Daily Mail. Health wealth and inequality are supposedly addressed by Centibale's work with youth in Botswana and Lesotho, who help develop long-term solutions. The U.S. Patent and Trademark Office, while acknowledging that it has unearthed no conflicting trademarks, has given the application the thumbs down. Eden stated that IT notes in a thorough finding that the categories are inadequately defined for the most part. The expert claims that the office informed applicants that their applications needed to clearly state which goods and services would be associated with their trademark usage or intended use. What are your thoughts on this? Let me see them in the comments. Thanks and have a nice day.